we've discovered for the first time the presence of zinc containing nanoparticles lodged within these wooden samples in the Mary Rose hull. The Mary Rose is a ship of Henry VIII. It sailed for over 30 years before tragically sinking in 1545. The part of the ship that we have and the objects that we have, they survived because they were buried under sediment and this stopped oxygen getting to them and stopped normal degradation processes. What we're seeing is that if we change the size of the materials, so go to the nanoscale, we get a lot of different properties. And what we want to know is, is why do, do we have these different properties from going to the nanoscale? Up to now, it's not been possible to obtain quantitative structural information on the nature of these deposits. Using this method, we have been able to do this and we've discovered for the first time the presence of zinc containing nanoparticles lodged within these wooden samples in the Mary Rose hull. The ID15 work has involved various different people. Um, we've got researchers from the Mary Rose, from the University of Sheffield, from Columbia, from Copenhagen, and obviously the scientists here as well at the ESRF. And it's only by pooling all that knowledge together that we've been able to try to start to answer these really complex questions.